So I bet you're wondering how we got here. Hi everybody, you know Michael. Here I am again. Because October's coming and I'm really into witches and Michael's really into making fun of me, we decided that it would be fun if we held a seance. To be clear, I pressured you for two months to allow me to do a seance in which I don't understand any of the ingredients. Going into this, like, I'm kind of like a believer-ish. I like find this sort of thing very interesting. Michael sure. believes in nothing ever. I'm not a soul, you're not a soul, there's no God. So, as we were going into the seance, I was like, yeah, it'll be like a joke, it'll be really funny, like, I'll wear the fucking witch costume, it'll be great. Here's what happened. We, <laughs> we have very different ideas about what this is going to be. Candace thought a seance, well, you correctly understood that a seance means just talking to spirits. My understanding of a seance, which I now have learned is wrong, is I will lie down in a pentagram with candles and we will summon a demon. Moving into this week, though, I went to a full moon witch party that a friend of mine at work has been learning to become a medium. And through these like two events leading up to today, I realized that I should probably be taking this a bit more seriously than I was. Michael definitely won't be taking it any more seriously than initially intended. Sure. Basically, it means I'm losing the witch costume. Else. Well, also there's the concern that we have like 16 candles here. You can easily <laughs> light up. I do have a shirt that I'm gonna change into. Yeah, we're gonna change. change out of this. We're back. I don't know a lot about holding a seance, but I do know that you're supposed to burn some stuff to like clear your energy and things like that. Um, but we've got some sage, some blue sage. It doesn't look that blue. Sure. That's not pretty good. So I think we'll just like clear the room. It's called smudging. Fun fact. So we're gonna smudge the room. Oh god. Okay. All right. So we're I'm gonna smudge you. Smudge me good. Just gonna. I'm clearing your energy. I'm gonna <laughs> wave it around you. We're great. We're great. <laughs> you know, make sure that all the bad spirits and anyone that wants to come through stays the fuck out of here because you're not welcome in this home. Uh, oh shit! I need to look at my rose quartz. <laughs> We got three candles, which is like three. We got candles made by Glade Plugins, smells like vanilla. We got candles from Old Farm that Candace bought. She spent $60 on candles recently and they all are worth it. From Old Farm? Isn't that what's called? It's called Little House Candles. That could easily be a farm. And those are all the candles we have. All right, so we've got our crystals laid out because I'm terrified. I'm not trying to fuck with the spirit world, okay? Except that's exactly what we're trying to do. I read somewhere that a good way to do a seance if you don't want a Ouija board because I'm very anti-Ouija board. We decided to go with a bell. In order to hang the bell, I've set up two cups because... This is a classy witch calling. All right, we gotta get, get comfortable, okay? All right. Get comfortable. It's not gonna happen. What? <laughs> Shut up, you don't know. <laughs> Somehow you blinked 30 times with your eyes closed. <laughs> I hate you so much. No. Alright. <laughs> what's the goal here? The goal is to talk to the spirit. I know, but what's this process going to look like? I don't know. Oh, so you really haven't looked up instructions. <laughs> wow, we're going to look so dumb. I think what you do is that you just sort of like, you know, like relax, you open yourself up. <laughs> You know that SNL skit with uh, who are the two Fred Armisen and the girl, and they do like the, the songs that they clearly have never practiced before together. So we're literally doing that, but say on style. We're like, oh, and then the spirits here now, getting us spirits with eyes unclosed. Look forward. Take three deep breaths, nose, and then out your mouth. Now you're still not relaxed, but now close your eyeballs. All right, and now just be aware of the sounds around. Feel the weight of your body on the ground. Now slowly scan down from your head to the bottom of your body. Just get a check in. Yeah, and see, it's much better if you do this. Right? Right, and then from there, what you have to do is right, so let's do the scan again since we just interrupted. Okay. We're feeling good, we're feeling relaxed. Um, a good visualization for this. Nothing says you. you're feeling good by like the tone that you say those words in every time. I can't do this with you. This was a horrible idea. Alright, bring it down, ready? Right? Right. Feeling good. Relax. Feeling relaxed. Relax your fucking self. You're so relaxed right now. <laughs> the demons are never gonna want to talk to us. Alright, 
right. Breathe deep and visualize our energy force or aura, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I'm going to stop laughing. Yeah, that was a sniffle. Is there anybody who would like to talk to us? <laughs> Your anxiety just spiked. Ready? Okay, come on. All right, who, who do we want to talk to? We should try to think of someone. Maybe we should try Ooh, to talk. I got one. Who? Adam West. Who's Adam West? He plays Batman. He died in a couple of years. I'm pretty sure he's dead. <laughs> we should try to contact Elizabeth Bathory. We need to pick someone we both know. I think it's a problem. <laughs> well, Elizabeth Bathory was crazy. She killed upwards of like 600 women. Let's do that one. Yeah. How'd she kill them? She would torture them. Oh, but she knows some demons at minimum. Oh my god. What's the starting sentence? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what you do. Alright, we're here now. <laughs> See? Just so how do you feel like, how do you, I don't know. <laughs> we are trying to contact Elizabeth Bathory. Mm -hmm. Elizabeth was a countess back in the 15 and 1600s. She contributes a lot to the Dracula myth and lore because she killed upwards of 600 women. And a lot of people in rumors say that she bathed in their blood. It's unclear as to whether or not there was any sexual aspect to this, but there are a lot of theories. Mm -hmm. Anyway, Elizabeth would be interesting to contact to see what the yeah. fuck she was doing that for. <laughs> so anyway. <clears throat> Is there anyone out there? Who wants to talk to us now? <laughs> I regret that. I see you to you. Yeah, that's hard. Um, but we're not looking for anybody. We're looking for Elizabeth. So Elizabeth. But if you're here and you're not Elizabeth, we're happy to talk to you. <laughs> but if you are Elizabeth, that's ideal. We're, we're really trying to talk to her. Um, so we've got a small bell here that we would appreciate if you would ring to let us know that you are present. And if you are present, we would love to be able to communicate with you, talk to you about what's... Fuck you! You asshole! Oh my god! Oh, let's get ready. <laughs> I'm too scared. Sorry. We do seem like assholes who are taking this seriously. That's the number one thing in all the articles I've searched about how to uh, summon a demon. It said, don't not take this seriously. <laughs> Great. It's like you will offend someone. All right, well, uh, we hope not to offend you, um, but if we have offended you, feel free to ring the bell. See, so we haven't offended anybody. That's nice. See, all right. If you're disgruntled and something's happened to you. That's ideal. It would just be really nice if you'd ring the bell. That way we could uh, have a nice little chat. So, it's been quite some time and the bell has not rung. I mean, it could be that no one's happy with the way that we're conducting this, which would be a fair thing to think. Alright, well, how about do we do this now? So, I got this shirt. It's from Tee Public, a website that I work at. Here's what you gotta do. There are one, two, three, four, five children in this. We have two people. So, instruction one didn't work. Instruction two, <laughs> pentagram. I've been trying to figure out how we can make a pentagram. Also, this shirt is available on Candace's Tee Public, Public store. store. Link below. <laughs> Your hair is gonna light up. I know. Yeah, whatever the candle. There's so much dirt out of that fucking couch. Alright. While you do that, I'm gonna pledge the rest of this. <laughs> so, to loosen the vibrations, <laughs> we need some pledge. Oh, <laughs> 
what a short, concise wish. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna do a chant now. Oh, 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 oh. I don't have words to express how sorry I am. Yeah, this video is probably terrible. What did you learn? I learned that if I ever want to continue exploring spirit realms, I should not be in your presence. I said, uh, we did this because I suggested it. I brought the instruction manual only one of the night. See, this is why no spirits wanted to fuck with us, is because they fucking knew that we were no good. More spooky vids to come. Yeah. I think I'll probably be reviewing the witch. Oh, that's a good one. You should see that. Yes. Um, Sign your name.